This is a tutorial video on how to carry out a guerrilla theater demonstration we call a GMO food dump. We're asking activists to perform these demonstrations outside of natural food stores like Whole Foods and Trader Joe's. Well, we're asking these stores to, to adopt the policies that they say that they support. So the first step is uh, you go into the store and you purchase a variety of these contaminated foods. So that means any non-organic foods that contain corn, soy, cottonseed, canola. Sugar is another ingredient, if not specifically identified as cane sugar. It most likely comes from genetically engineered sugar beets. Any animal products that are not organic are most likely derived from animals that were fed genetically engineered corn and soy and were most likely raised in CAFOs. Once you've purchased a selection of the GMO contaminated foods, you bring them out to the front of the store and display them to the public as foods that contain genetically engineered ingredients and that are also not labeled. You have a sign that says contaminated with GMO foods. So when you do these demonstrations, it's good to have a group of people. Three to five people is totally enough. But the more people that are there, the better. For the theatrical effect, um, we have had success in the past using hazmat suits in the demonstrations. So, if you can find a hazmat suit or a gas mask or some sort of dramatic costume, it can only make the demonstration more interesting and more effective. We ask that you interact with people, you talk to people about the issue. Bring a table, bring um, a trash can or some sort of bucket that is identified with sort of dramatic coloring that indicates that this is toxic, toxic food and we're putting it in a toxic place.